Oh yes, here we go, here we go. Ooh. Oh, that's actually a pretty awesome Hello, new intro. Everyone. I'm liking that. I'm Satoru Iwata Hello. from Nintendo. This is the so first hype. Nintendo Direct of 2015, and I would Yay. like to wish you all the best for this brand new year. <laughs> oh my gosh, first, yeah. Please take a look at this video. Based God Iwata. <laughs> okay, what's this? Huh. Okay, I'm not really sure what this is. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not really familiar with what this would be, so... <laughs> huh. Okay then, um... It looks a little bit mythological or something, I don't know. Huh. A lot of slow-mo action. <laughs> okay, so that was just a painting? Um... Oh, okay. Fire Emblem. Fire Emblem, yeah. I've played a little bit. i played the demo. Like, on the 3DS, like, Fire Emblem Awakening. Okay, so this... Hold on, I gotta turn down my volume. <laughs> Okay, so it's another 3DS one. They should have a Wii U version, that'd be kind of cool. Although, it's more a handheld game, but still, looks cool. I don't think I'll get it though. Japanese text? What's this? <laughs> Yo. Dude. Okay. Huh. But yeah, like I said, I'm not really that interested in Fire Emblem games. Gosh, it is so early though. Hmm. Fire Emblem. Yay. <laughs> okay, that's cool. The latest title in the yeah. Fire Emblem series will come to Nintendo 3DS. This game is developed okay, it's by the same good. team as Fire Emblem Awakening, and just like in that game, oh, okay. the character design for this new title will be by Mr. Kozaki Yusuke. However, hmm. the game content itself is completely new. Mr. Shinki Bayashi, Pretty a well-known comic book writer, joined the team to generate a unique atmosphere for this title. The Fire Emblem series huh has always asked players to make lots of small water. choices <laughs> that affect the world as they know it, from conversation choices huh. to battle tactics. In this new game, okay. you will make even bigger choices, and the effect of these choices on the world will be greater than ever. Yeah, I don't know. It is a game don't really... that will include hmm, I don't know. brand new but Like I said, I don't think the I'm getting this game. have never been seen in the series, up until now. Feel free to skip this part if Next, you want. <laughs> I'd like to talk oh, about a puzzle game that has been very Ooh. popular in Japan and is now coming to Europe and North America. Huh. Please take a look at this. What is game. this? Hmm. Okay. Mm. <laughs> Does look quite Japanese, tell you the truth. <laughs> okay, uh. Yeah. That sunburst, though. <laughs> Inspiration much? No, I'm getting around <laughs> I'm joking. Or if people, like, you know, those haters of me or whatever, they'd be like, oh, Lewis, you're just getting mad at Nintendo that you're using the sunburst. Because you're the only one that does that, according to you. Which, I mean. Oh, look at that, it's Mario. Dang, yo! I I know, like, oh, oh, okay, okay, uh, bro, bro, bro. Uh, there's this guy named Pepos or whatever. Uh, he talked about this game, although no one believed him. 
Dude, he was right all along. Hold him on. Now I actually may get this since it's Mario themed. <laughs> Looks a little bit Tetrisy and uh, Candy Crush type uh, thing. <laughs> you know. All about that music though. <laughs> Looks nice. Looks nice. Man, I really want to see some good games. So I mean, I'm not saying these are bad, but you know, I, I want to see some. You know. Maybe it's the new 3DS or a new Metroid puzzle or something, that'd be kind of cool. Is a puzzle game series which features hmm. RPG and puzzle and dragon. Okay. In this game, you can customize your party and go on adventures through dungeons. You will slide colorful huh. holes across the touch screen. Yeah, and, and then there's the Mario edition, Jason which I'm more interested in. <laughs> and in this Combo Super Breaker. Mario you play as Mario, Ooh, that looks so cool! Like the whole lighting and everything. Say Princess Peach from Look at Mario. that. You can form a party of beloved Mushroom Kingdom citizens, huh. like Mario, Nice. Luke, and you know what? I'm gonna open up my Mountain Dew. Buddies, like Koopa Troopa and Goomba. Mm. And they'll <laughs> up they battle. Oh, the nice. You saw looks cool. Video, I may actually be getting this game. And Puzzle and Dragon Super Mario Brothers Edition. Looks pretty interesting. Although, uh, if I get a Wii U soon, then I won't be thinking about the 3DS at all. <laughs> oh, available May. Okay, that's nice. Next, I'd like to introduce a new game to you for the first time. Ooh, Pokemon Shuffle. New game. This puzzle game is available Pokemon. from This is another Nintendo puzzle game? Are you kidding me? It looks it identical. Are you kidding me? You make matches. Of the same three or more Pokemon. Look, that's like this. Them from the screen and that looks like the same exact thing with a Pokemon skin. Pokemon Are you kidding Shuffle, me? There is a limit on how oh well. Many you Wasn't can there already a Pokemon Shuffle? Battle. Never mind. You must deal damage effectively. People just love so Pokemon so much they'll be like, hey, look at that. It's a brand new IP from Nintendo. The number of moves you or not IP, but you know. To a brand new game. It's totally not the same. No, I'm kidding. You can <laughs> Pokemon fans aren't like that. By collecting many the fan Pokemon base, I mean. And making them stronger. Actually, Some the Pokemon, Pokemon fan base is evolve. actually pretty nice. And are able to remove many Just other my Pokemon opinion. I don't know. I'm not really in it go. because, you know, it's like... In Pokemon Shuffle, I don't know. You start they don't force their opinion on you. And you use one nap every time you battle. Hmm. Run out but that's not what I'm here to talk about. <laughs> before you can battle again. Over time, you are hard I know a lot of people will be happy about the Fire Emblem because I know there's a lot of people that really love the series. You can also keep playing by using items of I actually really love the Fire Emblem stage in Smash Bros. With Nintendo e -shop fans. In addition, eh. there are okay, also then. various other items which can come in handy during battle and which can hmm. also be available through regular gameplay or through in-game in purchases, allowing players with different play style to enjoy the game. Pokemon Shuffle pretty good. will be available from Nintendo eShop in February. Now, let's move on okay. to Wii U. Wii U, let's go, let's go. Smash Bros. DLC. There are some Please. Wii software icons on the Wii U Wait. These icons Super Mario Galaxy 2. That have Please be a three. Wait a second. As downloadable Metroid Prime. And you can start each game directly from the Wii U menu. Oh, that's Without actually really cool. Look at that. Wii oh, so the, are they like ditching Wii, Wii mode in total? By switching the hardware function to Wii mode. <laughs> because of this, in the past. Dude, you couldn't distribute Wii disk software for download on Wii U. Now that we can oh, so it's just like eShop games or wait. On Wii U, we can make these titles available to download, and some huh. of the Wii games that were compatible okay. So yeah, it's just eShop games. So like Galaxy Two, that other game, and Metroid Prime. Only the Wii U gamepad too. The Wii console has come on. We need a new Metroid game. Catalog. But Wii U owners may not have had the chance the U, to the play Wii U is already games, two years old. Even if they need at least to announce something. Playing them when Actually, it's more than two years old now because it's 2015. Now that I think about it. We <laughs> hope these new possibilities will allow for almost three years old. Enjoy these Wii games more easily. 
Super Mario Galaxy hmm, 2 okay. will be available shortly、yes. after this presentation. Punch Out will be available Dude, on January s e Mario... Oh, Punch Out, that's、Metroid、what it was. Prime Trilogy, arriving on January 29th. Oh, okay, dude. In HD, though, like if you had like 16 by 9 widescreen or whatever, that would be so cool. We also plan to release more Wii titles on Nintendo eShop for Wii U. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's all for me. But I would prefer the physical disc. Let's pass it over to Bill Trinan from Nintendo of America for some more news. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Iwata. Let's get things rolling、oh, with Kirby、you. and the Rainbow Curse. In this clever Kirby game, are... guiding the mighty Puffball through treacherous <laughs> stages isn't your only goal. There are tons of collectibles to find in every stage,、huh. including hidden treasure chests. Touch one yeah, to see what prize you get,、uh, like、songs to listen to, or in game figurines.、They're,、Some、um, treasure chests are really hard to find, especially、analysis. considering that you have a limited amount of ink to draw rainbow ropes with. If you run out, Kirby may find himself in a tight spot. Levels like Blue Sky、huh. Palace have no ground, so run out of ink and you'll meet an ill fate. But it's all worth it for the figurines. You can take in their glory from different angles in the figurine showcase. Really? Is it worth hey, it? <laughs> it's kind of look like Amiibo. So it's kind of. And speaking of, Smash there's、Bros. plenty to do with Amiibo in Kirby and the Rainbow Curse. Once Ooh, per day, you can、really? select Amiibo to the Wii、Oops. U gamepad、yeah. controller to power up Kirby. Tapping the Kirby amiibo to the gamepad will let you use his star dash whenever you want, without having to collect 100 stars like usual. Oh, okay. Likewise, you can get a matching、yeah. hat from the King of the Mountain. I already kind of know about this. Plus six health bars instead of the normal four. And if you get the Meta Knight、huh. hat by using his amiibo, your Kirby's tap dash speed will increase. So, like, cheating, him to basically. Plow through weaker enemies. Wow, I just opened my mouth and I'm doing it all spilled everywhere like it f u z z And I'm sitting in my bed, so that's double the time. <laughs> But it is 6 a.m., so I'll wash up. The release by the of the、time. next day <gasps> of the Super Smash Bros. amiibo is let's go, right around let's the corner. Let's go, let's go, Sanic. Let's go, 11 new amiibo to hit store shelves in February. And I've got some exciting Dude, news. Dude, February. We're ready to announce a whole new wave of Super Smash Bros. amiibo. Yes! Duck Hunt, Duck Hunt, please, Duck Hunt. Oh, Pac Man! Wario, Wario, there's the WWW Wario. <laughs> no, Earth. Nice! Oh my gosh, yes. Uh, games and Wario is gonna be happy. So they got their, he got his nice Wario amiibo. Yeah, let's go. Pac Man, no, I'm getting Pac Man for sure. This lineup includes、Ooh. Mario. Oh, okay,、Luigi, so that's what that one. Okay. Yoshi, oh! Bowser, Dang, those look really、Toad. good. And they'll be launching alongside the Wow, those game, actually look really good. To the next level. Mario, Party Mario Party 10. 10. Yes. You may have noticed some of these characters also appeared in the Super Smash Bros. series of Amiibo. Well,、Perfect. regardless which version of character you buy, they'll function exactly the same way. I like、Check、that background. Check in at the address、now. on screen as we update this list, so you can find. Oh, so you can literally just buy the Mario Amiibo from Smash Bros. and use it in Mario Party 10. That's cool. Mario Party <laughs> the traditional party mode, the Bowser Party mode we introduced、huh. in E3, and a new mode called Amiibo Party. In this mode, you and there's yeah, there's that secret amiibo that I've pointed that out like before. <laughs> like I said, playing、um, on a special board related to that character. For example, on the Mario、uh, board, you might encounter an event where you use a mushroom to suddenly grow or collect coins. I was telling my brother about how. On the Luigi map, you、oh、might have、gosh. to suck up your rival's stars and coins using the Poltergeist. I'm really hoping、Each、that this is back to the classic、trait. games. So there's a lot of fun to be had on the different boards. You can also select Dude, this looks like it actually could be really good. <laughs> like not no par- Mario Party Nine stuff. Deciding which item stuff. to bring along <laughs> might just be the key to your victory. So choose wisely. Nice. The game will work. Yeah, I'll probably get that game.、Amiibo. Whoa! Luigi, that Peach, box art Toad, though. Yoshi, looks so all、oh, Luigi. Look at that. I'm so getting Luigi、Donkey、first. Donkey Kong and Wario. Wow! If you decide to use your Super Smash Brothers amiibo in Mario Party, I'm so 10, getting that Luigi figure. You will need、figure. to erase that figure's Smash Brothers amiibo data. Mario Party、oh. 10 will be available in stores and on the、oh, well, Nintendo eShop. Oh well, I'm, tra- I'm trying to get all the amiibos now. You have to have an amiibo to play amiibo party. Huh? That that、so、box art, I actually really like that. Like I like their style, like how they're. Which will no way. The Mario amiibo from the Super Mario series I mentioned earlier. Oh. Another game that will use one of the new amiibo from、nice. the Mario series is Captain Toad Treasure Tracker. Captain Toad Treasure Tracker, let's go. 
The Let's go. From the Super Mario Brothers line will Nathan was telling me that that, that game. game's actually really good. When you tap the Toad amiibo on Why? your Wii U gamepad, Japanese, of course, they had stage, these Japanese. Hide from the player, waiting to be found hide and seek style. And Ooh, so kind of like the nice, like the new Luigi U, Luigi. The same day, the Toad amiibo thing. becomes that, available. Dude, that's awesome. Next, let's Ape switch over toe. to another <laughs> Wii U title coming in 2015, Splatoon. <laughs> <laughs> Splatoon is an action-packed shooting game where you play as squid-like oh, that can Ooh, nice. Splatoon, let's go. Characters and mark their enemy's territory I don't know, I've said my opinion before, before, but this game's looking better and better. Looks like a great party online game. Multiplayer mode and a single player mode. But this time we'd like to tell you about the Inkling hmm. central hub that connects all the game modes together. Didn't we already see this trailer? When you first start up the game, you'll land in this plaza. Oh. Hey, that's actually really Inkings cool. Sent here by Amiiverse will be walking around, and you can communicate with them. Nice. The tower you see right now is an important landmark. Really? The tower, Looks like the, the online Eiffel Tower much? With other Inklings from around the world. Online? Oh! You may have noticed, but each Inkling is equipped with their nice. own weapon and outfit. Can you, like... Equipment Talk to these people, the maybe? With in-game money you earn by playing multiplayer mode. At the shopping oh, that's center, actually really nice. There's a weapon shop run by a militaristic crab and a headgear shop <laughs> where a shy sea anemone is working as a store clerk. There's also a clothing yeah, really shop cool. and a shoe shop. This makes me respect this game a lot more. You can switch equipment you've purchased at any time in the plaza. For weapons, you select a set of three at a time. Your go-to weapon of choice nice. for dealing with the most enemies is, of course, your main weapon. You'll also have a backup sub-weapon to help create diversions or block your enemy's path. And for special occasions... Oh yeah, I hope you guys like the quality be too, because I actually got some pretty good quality. Damage, your special weapon. Whoa! Depending Bro, that setup, looks so cool. You'll have to adjust your strategy. I'm actually really hyped for this game. You can also modify your character's stats, such as strength and speed, by choosing the right gear that for your goop, head, That goop reminds shoes. me of Sunshine so much. Different players will respond to different styles of custom outfits. So if you want, you back can focus at, on the first E3, or well, the, not the first E3, duh. You can also but check back out at other E3, outfits and I actually thought it was closet, going to be a Sunshine so remake. So it's a good place to get inspired. Try entering a battle with new clothes and equipment. So I saw that you squid from the ink. A new way to fight. Splatoon will be available in hype. stores. Then I found Nintendo out it was e just Splatoon. This May. I was upset, but you know, Thanks to Hyrule Splatoon, Warriors, it's Wii U a new IP. Looks already good. fighting hordes of enemies as Link, Impa, Darunia, and tons of other beloved Zelda characters. But Don't tell me Zelda it's more DLC, isn't it? Nintendo 3DS, the Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Yeah, Wii. that's right. So in honor of that game. We have some new downloadable content on the way for Hyrule Warriors. Tingle huh. is ready for action. Real Just be glad he's on your side. His Re main weapon is really? his bones, but he'll also attack enemies <laughs> with a giant wallet full of rupees. Are his you Kululimpa dance and even a fatal kiss of death? Re As for Young Link, his main weapon is the Kokiri sword. Well, young he also Link comes equipped oh. with a fierce Didi's mask, allowing him to briefly transform and unleash powerful special huh. attacks. Both of these characters Dude. are included in the Majora's Mask pack, that is which so cool. also comes with a new adventure mode map and three additional costumes when it becomes available ooh, ooh, on ooh, February 5th. Ooh. That looks like Skull Kid and um, Impa, maybe? Next, we have a new oh, trailer. Wow. I don't know what that other one is. Xenoblade. Xenoblade Chronicles X that showcases various locations for oh, Xeno, planet okay. Mira. <laughs> I don't know. I say Xeno, but it's Xeno. Dude. <laughs> Ooh. Huh. No way. Dude, I actually am really enjoying like Chugga's Let's Play of the first one. Or not the first, oh, I don't even know. Maybe it's the first one, but still. What the heck, man? Wow. Okay.
And there we go, we got ourselves Shulk in 1080 PhD on the nice Wii U. Looking good. Why is he so far ahead? I mean, seriously, he's like, wait up. <laughs> Where's Naked Shulk? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> That's a joke. It's Smash Bros. Yeah. <laughs> this game looks so beautiful, though. Just look at this. Dude, and to think that they're not even done with it. Got yeah, robots. <laughs> Platforming, of course. I mean, okay, never mind. <laughs> Dang, dude, dude! Oh my gosh! Look at that! That is craziness. This game looks so gorgeous. Like you can see so far out. Oh my gosh! This will really show off what the Wii U can do. <laughs> really show off its power. Hmm. Bro. Xenoblade Chronicles X. Oh my gosh. Stay tuned for that more is so epic. On Xenoblade Chronicles X in the near future. At last year's huh. E3, we announced a new game cool. for Wii U. Its name, Mario yeah. vs. Donkey Kong Tipping Stars, is yeah. centered on an important new feature. Now, there's a new yeah, way the to game enjoy pad. the puzzling, toy-guiding touch gameplay that fans love. I, know, As with I hope this is just an eShop game. You can create your own levels, and then share them with other yeah. players online. But now, you can reward the people who make your favorite levels using the all-new tipping system. Hmm. As you beat levels, you can earn up to three stars based on I always loved making and levels. And you can cash in those stars to earn That was always my favorite part. Creation. So if you like a level someone built, tip them some stars sometime. That way, they'll be able to create even more imaginative levels using the stars you tip them. Hmm. For the first time, That's really awesome. the Wii U game will also be releasing the game on Nintendo 3DS. Both of these download Wait, titles what? are available for purchase directly from the Nintendo eShop. And we plan on giving anyone Dude. who buys the Wii U game a free download code for the game on Nintendo 3DS, and vice versa. Wow! So now you can play the game on your oh. system of choice, or even share levels between versions of the game through Miiverse, which is built directly. Oh, that into is the game. so awesome! Mario vs. Donkey Kong Tipping Stars is available exclusively through the Nintendo eShop on Wii U and Nintendo 3DS, okay. March 5th. March 5th. Nice. Now, okay. here's a quick look at some great games coming to Wii U and Nintendo 3DS from some of our development partners. Hmm. Wii U is a new project to be launched. Um, four people have been working on the map of the world to be able to do Okay. ワナを解除しながら、ワナを解除しながら敵を蹴散らして、え、お宝を強奪してくる。お宝を強奪してくるというのが基本的なゲームルールになります。<笑> Project Treasure. Hmm. Looks interesting. Thank you, Mr. Harada. This title is being developed exclusively for <laughs> Then it goes to this lighthearted stuff. Is from Bandai Namco Entertainment. Uh, In so Elliot funny. Quest, you'll explore an open world filled with hidden secrets and powerful guardians. Okay, so this looks like a in the game. Elliot's Curse of Immortality. Adventure through dungeons as you collect abilities and spells while questing to defeat 16 unique bosses and unlock multiple endings. With the unique and innovative gameplay and beautiful puzzles, Black delighted the press, mm. the players, and many judges, 
scoring itself international prizes. I believe I saw this a, a review on this on um, Curiosity and CGR Undertow. I don't know if you guys know who that is, but uh, it's uh, just now a on Wii U, you'll be able to YouTube immerse channel. yourself in a meditative game of black on your TV or off screen with the gamepad. It's all about bringing your paintings and your imagination to life mm. with a touch of your finger. <laughs> With its cartoon it's graphics and awesome. touch controls, Citizens of Earth has a modern look and feel, but at heart, Citizens it's a retro Japanese style RPG from Eden Industries and Atlas USA. Players take on the role of Vice President of Earth. Yes, you heard that <laughs> correctly. The Vice President of Earth, who awakens the morning after his election to find that his whole Sorry planet that, guys. has gone berserk. To get to the bottom of things, oh, wow. you have to team up with an odd assortment of more than 40 characters scattered around the game world. With a humorous story, pretty interesting, and plenty of I guess. And side quests, I mean, for an indie this game, this game looks kind of interesting. Played as a casual adventure or a full-on RPG. The original Gunman Clive was a breakout hit on the Nintendo 3DS eShop, and now the hardcore gunfighter is back in Gunman Clive 2. This time, there are four playable huh. characters to choose between, each with their own unique abilities plus more bosses, more levels, and yes, more colors. Another exclusive more is headed to the eShop on Nintendo 3DS too. New episodes of Moon Chronicles will continue uh. Renegade Kid's sci-fi first-person adventure. The three remaining episodes in Major Kane's Lunar Journey will be released on the same day for download, giving fans the opportunity to experience the entire season without hmm. delay. Players can purchase the new content individually as separate episodes or choose to go for the I don't really packs, play too much first person shooter all three games. three remaining episodes for a lower price. I have played this some month, though. Sega will be releasing a new batch More of, a of 3D classics for Nintendo 3DS. Ooh. The first new 3D remake will be 3D Afterburner 2. Followed oh, okay, that would that's a great song. game to put in 3D. 3D Outrun. Not so much. Okay, that Fantasy is a good one to put in 3D. And 3D Thunderblade. <laughs> yeah, Each these are great games to have in 3D. A full fledged vintage arcade experience, recreating the environment down to the mechanical sound of an arcade machine. From Atlas and Spike huh. Tunesoft comes a Nintendo 3DS exclusive. Oh, so it's a recreation, it's just not, a, it's not just core. Okay, that's good. An RPG experience like no other. Etrian Mystery Dungeon gives players the freedom to create mm. their own eclectic party of heroes like in the Etrian Odyssey series, and then take that party on a near-infinite dungeon-exploring, loot-hunting quest, just like in the Mystery yeah. Dungeon series. I don't think I'm getting this. Story of Seasons is the rebirth so. of the Bokujo Monogatari series that has sold close to 10 million units worldwide by charming gamers around the globe with its fun combination of farming and life simulation. The latest entry is all about connecting mm. with other lands across mm. the game world or with other players online, a first for the series. And with the introduction of a new safari area, players will now have access to many new exotic animals such as penguins, elephants, and camels. But of course, the beloved farming and relationship building gameplay you love will make a return when the game comes exclusively um. to the Nintendo eShop <laughs> on Nintendo 3DS. Not quite Reggie as good as Animal Race, though. No, special I'm announcement. <gasps> but first, let's dig into one what? more Nintendo 3DS. Reggie Amiibo. A new entry in the Fossil <laughs> Fighter series is stomping your way. So get ready to hop in your own custom vehicle fossil and explore fighters, the I've never even 3D heard of this, world of Fossil Fighters truth. Frontier, filled with buried fossils just waiting to be dug up. <laughs> Any fossil you find will yeah, yeah, be revived I've never as a vivisaur, and then pitted against other vivisaurs in massive reptile rumbles of prehistoric proportions. Two players Looks kinda team interesting. up to battle each other's vivisaurs online in tournaments to determine a reigning champion, or up to six players locally. Three friends can also team up okay. online to explore the world together, dig up fossils, and battle as allies against rogue vivisaurs. And for those who feel their vivisaur team is ready for the fires of battle, head over to the new Fossil Stadium, an arena Looks good. where you can enter tournaments, refine your skills, and see how your team stacks up against the rest. The game Fossil Fighters Frontier is coming to life on March know. 20th of 2015, in stores and on the Nintendo eShop. Alright, that's okay. it for now. Let's pass it over to Reggie. 
Reggie, Thanks, let's Bill. go. In March of 2011, Yo. Nintendo 3DS launched in the Americas. Base God Reggie. And later on, it was joined by Nintendo 3DS XL For real. and Nintendo 2DS. This family Wait, of handheld systems has been home to a varied and robust lineup of games. Please. From the new titles in the Super Mario, Zelda, and Animal Crossing series. Please. Games like Kid wait a second, wait a second. Rising, Is Fire it Emblem Awakening, Star Fox new 3DS? AD, Please, new 3DS. Today, we'd like to share with you our plans for the future of Nintendo 3DS in the Americas. Yes. By introducing N new you Nintendo to the 3DS. Come on. Of the Nintendo 3DS family. <laughs> new It'll 3DS. To play Let's go. All of the titles I just mentioned. Horrible as name, well as many but let's new go. Games that are still on the way. Please take a look. <laughs> yes, I told you so. What? What? Dude. Yo. New Nintendo 3DS XL. Wow, look at that. And then the 3D slider, yeah, of course. Uh huh, yeah. Pretty much, like, I've seen the new Nintendo 3DS before, like, obviously, but I'm so glad it's coming to America now, though. Oh, and the Bebo scanning, okay. I didn't even know about this. <laughs> huh, yeah. Faster downloads? Okay, that's cool. Yeah, I kind of knew about that already, but... <laughs> Faster processing power? Yeah. Yeah, I know it takes forever for the regular 3DS to get <laughs> Smash Bros. up and running, so I'm definitely gonna have to get one of those and then do just do a system transfer. The new I'm assuming they're gonna be like 200. System will release in North America oh, look at that box. On February 13th, 2000. February 13th. It features a number of new enhancements designed to offer the smoothest and most engrossing on-the-go gaming hmm. possible. Now is the best time to be a part of the Nintendo that Mario pin, generation. Though. With games like The Legend of Zelda, Majora's Mask 3D, <laughs> and Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate on the way. The new Nintendo 3DS XL is hmm. a great new reason to play Codename Steam and to replay recent releases like Super Smash Bros. for Nintendo 3DS. To see games yeah. in 3D, the screen Plus, I want to be able to see them in 3D. Nintendo 3DS needed to be viewed from the very center. So if your face or hands <laughs> move unintentionally, you aren't able to properly experience the 3D effect. For this reason, I'm glad they're acknowledging this. Simply turn the 3D off. But that's about to change, because new Nintendo 3DS and I'm so glad of that too. Brand new, super stable, face tracking 3D technology. It's inward Which is amazing. Actually tracks the position of your face as you play games, dynamically adjusting the 3D sweet spot to ensure stable viewing at a wider angle, even during frenetic games. Which like is Super amazing. Smash Just, I'm so glad that they fixed the 3D. And because it's a hardware feature, it works with all Nintendo 3DS games. In addition to face tracking hmm. 3D, there are physical enhancements to the system as well. The yeah. big new addition is the C stick. Although it may look like a small uh, button, I wouldn't it necessarily call it a C stick, but from it's and allows yeah. for intuitive control. Apparently, now it's pretty much just improved control. It's not like a button or anything. It doesn't like move around. So, for example, in Super Smash Brothers for Nintendo 3DS, the C stick allows you to execute smash attacks with ease. You can also enjoy using the C-Stick with previously hmm. released Circle Pad Pro compatible titles like Steel Diver, Sub Wars, Ooh. Resident Evil Revelations, and more. The processing power of the Sorry new Nintendo some 3DS XL has noise. also just seen a boost a compared loud. to the previous model. And this power is for more than just super stable hmm. face tracking 3D technology. It also makes the entire system run smoother speeding up the home menu and its related applications Dude, like the internet that's, browser that's nice though and me maker me maker
while about speeding it? up boot up times for games like Super Smash Bros. for Nintendo 3DS and Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate. Yeah, because I know it takes forever for that game to start up. Available to developers <laughs> who wish to use it to power future games as well. Hidden beneath the touchscreen, you'll find another new feature that you may be familiar with from Wii U. It's called Near Field Communication, or <laughs> NFC for short. Hmm. This wireless oh. communication allows new Nintendo 3DS XL to interact with Amiibo figures. <laughs> okay, After yeah, so you can just put it on the touchscreen. Super Smash Brothers for Nintendo 3DS <laughs> will be the first Amiibo compatible title when played on new oh, Nintendo nice. 3DS XL. You'll be able to power up your Super Smash Brothers series Amiibo on the go with hmm. all the gear you've already unlocked in the game. Booyah. <laughs> just by tapping your Amiibo to the touchscreen. New that is Nintendo so awesome. New Nintendo 3DS XL also has a slightly longer battery life than previous models and will now automatically adjust the brightness that's, of the screen that's good, that's good. based on lighting conditions. So you can enjoy playing huh. comfortably while also saving battery life. With that is Nintendo actually really awesome. XL, there's also a change to the memory card compatibility. In order to maintain oh, the system size while good. enhancing the hardware specifications and performance, we decided to use smaller micro SD cards instead of the standard oh. SD cards. A 4 gig micro oh. SD card will come with the new hardware. Those of you currently enjoying uh, Nintendo 3DS can transfer save data and continue gaming on the new hardware. I'm so glad about that because, like, seriously, I, I'm going to have to transfer my, like, Smash Bros. and stuff. The new Nintendo 3DS I'll probably get, like, a 16 gig card so that way I can put Donkey Kong Country Return 3D on there, too. On February 13th if you, yeah, if you guys didn't know that, I actually have that game on my second SD card. I have two SD cards. However, you can use an existing AC adapter from any system in the Nintendo DSi oh, yeah. or Nintendo 3DS family, or purchase one separately. The yeah, I'm still using my Nintendo original DSi charger, which I've had for nearly three here. years now. Seeing truly, actually, no, game. more than three years. So, let's take a look I'm at still, how some still going good. games will create fresh experiences on the new Nintendo 3DS XL. Okay, Bill. Thanks, Bill. Ready. Let's go. The games keep coming <laughs> in 2015. A month after the launch of new Nintendo that background, 3DS though, looks XL, so cool. Abraham Lincoln will bring together heroes from classic literature and American folklore Abraham. to fend off an <laughs> alien. <laughs> I'm joking. Codename Steam comes to us oh, from okay. the creators of Fire Emblem and Advance Wars. Codename Steam. Their new hybrid of turn-based strategy and real-time action plays like nothing else out there. Hmm. It's all about picking Looks the right nice, I guess. I don't, I don't know. I've told, I said this before, but I, I don't think I'm getting this game. To outthink and outgun hordes of intelligent enemies. Manipulating the camera is key when scouting and planning out strategic attacks. Luckily, you can easily control the camera using the touchscreen, hmm. or by playing on a new Nintendo okay. 3DS XL system, you can use the new C-Stick to adjust the camera and plan your next move. And best of all, Codename Steam will Ooh. be one of the first Nintendo 3DS games to use Amiibo. Believe it or not, the Fire Emblem characters that appeared in Super Smash Bros. Huh. can join your team. They won't interfere with your oh, wow. storyline, <laughs> but tap an Amiibo of a Fire Emblem character like Marth or Ike to the new Nintendo Dude, 3DS XL Touch that Fire Emblem character though, that looks such, such a good Amiibo, I, I'm battle. serious. In the position of Fire Emblem, Amiibo characters that fall in battle cannot be revived at checkpoints during a fight. You'll have to wait until the match is over and tap the amiibo on the touch screen again to have that hero rejoin your team. It's an added sure. risk that strategy fans will love. Plus, the Fire Emblem characters wield okay. weaponry pulled straight from their core series, like Marth's Sacred Sword, Okay, Falcon. that's cool. It's definitely a heavy hitter, but his rapier is even better for striking weak spots. And his special, the Load Star, heals a substantial amount of damage for all I can't wait to see, like, how, how much stuff they can bring when it comes Ike, to his blessed Amiibo Regal compatibility. That's going to be really cool. Shockwaves. He also comes armed with the wide-swinging axe, Irvin, and his special move, Ether. The Ike Amiibo yeah, Amiibo are definitely not your with typical Skylanders type. Later this spring. <laughs> They're and a lot more than that. If you didn't manage to pick up a Marth Amiibo when they launched last year, you're in luck. 
We're planning on bringing more to the U.S. <laughs> so stay tuned for more details. Codename Steam launches on Nintendo 3DS Mars, and yeah, on about that. Nintendo 3DS XL <laughs> with enhanced features on March 13th in stores and on the Nintendo eShop. Ace Combat okay, Assault yeah. Horizon Legacy Plus is back with new features you can only experience on the new Nintendo 3DS XL. With the improved 3D view, players will feel like they're in the middle okay. of a heart-pounding dogfight from the cockpit of an ultra-realistic aircraft. And, and then, yeah, with the, uh, the C -stick and new the 3DS and ZL new better 3D and stuff, that's gonna be cool. control over the skies. The developers have also collaborated with Nintendo to provide special air Mario that can be unlocked in game or by Bowser. Oh, Star Fox, dude, that's so the that's so cool. Combat will be available in stores or on the Nintendo 3DS eShop starting February 13th. <laughs> Next, I have some follow-up information about the new Nintendo 3DS XL exclusive version of Xenoblade Chronicles, Ooh. which we announced for Japan. But what about the regular uh, It's a 3DS. remake of the original Wii game like new 3DS designed to make full use of the new Nintendo 3DS XL. <laughs> yeah. The new version offers 3D visuals and yeah, we already heard about this the maps and character stats on the bottom screen. There's also a yeah. bonus mode where you can view 3D models of the characters. Since the developer oh, of the cool. Wii version, Monolith Soft, is currently hard at work on mm, I feel like the Wii version looks better, but this we still looks pretty good. I mean, for a handheld system, it's good. The same developers who expertly ported Donkey Kong Country Returns from the Wii to the Nintendo 3DS. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> Xenoblade Chronicles 3D will be available in April 2015, exclusively for new Nintendo 3DS. <sighs> okay, that's actually cool. There's another brand new game coming to the Nintendo 3DS eShop. Let's start with a trailer. Another brand new. <laughs> yep, don't know it. I mean, obviously, it's a, if it's a brand new game, I'm open to new games, but still. Okay, so it's like a third person shooter type game. Probably won't be getting it. Created by a small okay, team of three Fall. talented indie developers looks, called uh, Looks pretty nice, I guess. Iron Fall will bring fast-paced shooting action straight to your handheld. The game is perfectly suited for using yep. the C stick on new Nintendo 3DS XL. It may just give you the edge you need to fight oh, okay. invasion. It can also be played on any Nintendo 3DS or 2DS system. Look out for Ironfall on the Nintendo yeah. 3DS eShop soon. I feel like they're releasing way too many 3DS systems. We are pleased to announce today that Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate will receive a special edition new I hope Nintendo the new 3DS, 3DS is the final 3DS system America, they release Europe. and then they finally just this go into a real new 3DS. I mean, to, uh, DS, you know, a new DS system. Like the HDS, I mean, that would be so GameStop. perfect. Well, now pass Which I actually thought of that a long time ago, but then Nintendo Hawk Fujimoto wants to mention it in one of his videos. Tell us a little bit more about That's actually really cool, though. The limited edition. I might get that. Mm. お届けできるの大変嬉しく思っております。本タイトルですけど、もちろんニューニンテンドー3Dsの対応しておりまして、Cスティックこちらの方はですね、クエスト中のカメラ操作で使っていただけます。ぜひこのモンスターハンター 皆様のプレイヤーのスタイルにあった。Like you can actually even hardly see the pixels. I mean, even for me and I'm watching on a smaller screen. <laughs> I mean, a bigger screen, sorry. <laughs> yeah, like I can barely see the pixels here, which is actually really good. And this is expanded, like, the, it will be smaller, you know, it will be on a smaller screen. Although that might actually be almost close to life size when it comes to a uh, 3DS screen. Just what the view window that I'm seeing anyway. Wow, 44 minutes already, jeez. 
How long is this going on for? <laughs> you can stop talking about this game now, no, okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay, so there's going to be like a puzzle swap. I love the, I love Street Pass so much. Like, I love going, collecting the puzzle pieces and stuff, you know, that's always fun. Yay. Thank you, Tsujimoto-san. Let's finish with a title we announced in our last Nintendo Direct. Love it or fear it, huh. The Legend of Zelda Majora's, oh, Mask, Majora's Mask is an emotional experience. Yeah, yeah, I knew it. new Nintendo 3DS XL, you'll be even more... It's funny how the last Nintendo Direct, they thanks to started with this game, and in this technology. Nintendo Direct, they're finishing Another with it. Another improvement to the original <laughs> that you can only experience on this new system is full 360-degree camera control. Simply slide your finger on the C-stick, oh. peer around the corners, and take in the scenery. I'm glad they're doing a full remake of this, though. We've also finalized the release date. The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask 3D will be available oh. on February 13th of 2015. And Zelda fans, if you pre-order code name oh, Steam okay, that's Sun, good. you'll receive a Majora's Mask pin at the time of pickup while supplies last. Oh, I, that's so February cool. But I'm not going to be pre-ordering Codename well, Steam. That's the problem. It's also, the same day that new Nintendo 3DS XL becomes available. And what better way to celebrate a dual release than with something like this? Huh. Introducing new Nintendo Whoa! 3DS XL. Dude. Dude. Mask style. I'm the getting that way one. to play what is arguably the most fascinating Dude, Zelda that looks game so ever made. awesome. And just one of the few Oh my gosh. When the system launches on February Dude, that box art too that Well, that's oh, it for me today. Oh my gosh, I Thanks so hope watching. I can get that. <laughs> Dude.